Well, social distancing measures are having some unintended negative consequences for the nation's bud supply. Today, the Eagles stepped up to encourage people to donate. Eyewitness News reporter Dan Koob is live at Lincoln Financial Field, where the team is hosting a blood drive. Dan. Good afternoon, Janelle. That's right. The pandemic forcing the Red Cross. Of course, they need blood during this pandemic and they are hosting along with the Eagles. This blood drive here today, high inside Lincoln Financial Field up in the Touchdown Club. One of the first of those to donate this morning, head coach Doug Peterson. There are safety and health measures in place. Anyone entering the stadium must wear a mask. Now, if you're asking yourself why do this at the link, it's because it's huge. It's a big building. That way, proper social distancing can be observed for those who are donating. The Red Cross says that someone in the U.S. needs blood every two seconds and that every donation can save up to three lives. I think we all need to figure out numerous ways to help, and this is just one of them. Um, there's a lot of a lot of people in need right now, and uh, we have to we have to figure out everything in our power to help out whether it means uh, giving blood or helping the medical professionals we know and so this is one one piece now it's important to note that the team wants people to know that there are no more slots available to actually come and donate blood today that's because everyone who was able to do so today did th did so rather through an appointment to observe social distancing if you're interested in donating some of your own blood the red cross encourages you to go to their website to find some other local opportunities live this afternoon at lincoln financial field dan Coob, cbs3 eyewitness news jim the eagle setting a good example there dan thank you